Morocco's Foreign Minister Nasir Bourita met separately on Friday with both the head of the High Council of State based in the Libyan capital Tripoli, Khalid al-Mishri, and the Speaker of Libya's Parliament in the East, Aguila Saleh. As part of Morocco's efforts to resolve the political crisis in the country, the new round of inter-Libyan talks on key institutional appointments are the latest of several held in Morocco. With Morocco's efforts and under the supervision and patronage of His Majesty the King, we have finally achieved the formation of an executive power based on a presidential council composed of a president and two deputies, and a government of national unity that has won the confidence of the House of Representatives, taken the constitutional oath and begun its work. We now wish it success and that Libya emerges from its crises. We are optimistic about our presence in Morocco and about this mediation between the Libyan parties, the House of Representatives and the Council of State. The efforts have not ended since the beginning of 2014 until the end of 2015. We had the Skihat agreements, and God willing, we are moving towards holding parliamentary and presidential elections at the end of this year. Germany will host a new set of peace talks later this month, with Libya's transitional government due to attend, as the formal UN-led truce signed last October is to see the unification of the country's divided institutions, launching reconstruction efforts in preparation for the December vote.